I didn't like working with him, man. It's just that damn simple. I didn't like it. I mean, but I, you weren't an athlete and you weren't a journalist. And the, the absence of the two components left people wondering, why should we listen to you? What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Without further ado, let's go straight to the video. So it's been two years since Max Kellerman departed from ESPN First Take. And for some reason, Stephen A. Smith is still bragging that he forced ESPN to demote him to radio and eventually get him fired. Stephen A. Smith recently appeared on the Joe Biden podcast where he detailed the moment that led to the network removing Max Kellerman from ESPN First Take. Stephen A. Smith basically confirmed that he threatened to quit the show if ESPN didn't fire Max Kellerman, which was reported back in 2021, I remember, if I remember correctly, um, but Stephen A. Smith denied it at the time. And, you know, I just find Stephen A. Smith's comments on Max Kellerman to be very hypocritical because, you know, he's been out here complaining that Skip Bayless had Shannon Shop removed from Undisputed. And plus, on top of that, we all saw how Stephen A. Smith treated Max Kellerman. Um, he will constantly berate him, um, just yell at him, scream at him as if he was one of his children. And, you know, basically doing the exact same thing Skip Bayless was doing to Shannon Sharp. Yeah. Chip experience, the this, point this is, is, this is why I get annoyed talking basketball either. with you. Because you bring up irrelevant, nonsensical points you that have absolutely nothing to do. That, how many years ago was that? How was the game played? All right, Who are you with going the against? We got to go. Uh, the guy Styles. Who Luka Doncic. Here's what Stephen A. Smith had to say about his time working with Mike Skellerman. I didn't like working with him, man. It's just that damn simple. If you looked at the content emanating in the social stratosphere, meaning YouTube and other components that you use to measure one's cachet, uh, uh, Q ratings, focus groups, all of these different things, it was like... I was damn near doing the show by myself because we were oceans apart in terms of cachet. Well, how are you oceans apart from me if you sit right across from I've me? Been very years. honest and very consistent about it. There's nothing personal. We didn't have, we weren't enemies or anything. Now, to be real, we ain't spoke since other than high and by, you know, or if I had to go on the show when they were doing the morning show, I would get interviewed. But there's been no conversations since, and that's fine with me. There's, there's, no, there's no problem, because it wasn't like we were boys or anything like that. But at the end of the day, it was all business to me, and it was about, look, man, I'm trying to win, and I don't believe I can win with you. Again, just to be clear, I'm not really criticizing Stephen A. Smith for wanting Max Kellerman off the show or the ESPN executives for completely removing him off the network. Of course, the ratings for ESPN First Take have increased ever since his departure, but I just don't think the way Stephen A. Smith is handling the subject is the right way. You know, Max Kellerman hasn't appeared on the program for for nearly three years now, and you know, Stephen A. Smith won. You know, he got his way, and Max Kellerman is now unemployed. Yet, Stephen A. Smith is still bringing it up two years later. Like, he's bragging about firing him and not being okay working with him and, and bringing up all those unnecessary details that no one needs to know. You know, basically kicking a dead horse at this point. And, you know, you don't see Skip Bayless doing any of these things. For someone who says his issues with Max Kellerman are not personal but business, it, it doesn't look that way to me. For me, here's one of the reasons Stephen A. Smith has a problem with Max Kellerman. You, you mentioned obviously Max is going to get in here. And like I said, I'm in the streets. Max almost seems blacker than you, Stephen A. <laughs> with, 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 with what time he, with, with his time coming, time you know, time with his commentary. Time, 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 with all due respect, my brother. You <laughs> I'm just you, saying, dog. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm, I'm just a, saying. I'm going to check you right now. You don't cross I'm the line. I'm just saying. Time, time, time. Wait a minute. You don't cross the line. <laughs> Tio recently shared that clip on Twitter, and that did not sit well with Stephen A. Smith who is now claiming that he's considering exposing Tio on his podcast this upcoming Monday. Anyways guys, let me know down in the comments what you guys think about this whole situation. What, what do you think about Stephen A. Smith basically bragging about firing Max Kellerman? Or any other thoughts you have, just leave it down below. As always, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.